Holy crap. There's only all the trash in here. So. loose glitter. So guys, I've been starting to do nails again. I used to do them a lot. I was pregnant with my daughter and stuff. But this is so cool. It just means like if every store's done a different plan of green, each one of the other plan of green is different. Hopefully it's not back into some type of normalcy because dumpster diving has sucked here lately. But see you soon. Look at all this. I hope you guys can see this. Oh shoot, I'm gonna have to get in. Alright, well there's a lot of stale stuff. I got some urban decay stuff already, so I'm gonna get in here and see what I can find. Um so you're right. Well, I just clean that. How cute. Okay, so I mean some first aid beauty products again. So I did go to an Ulta. Here's a perfume. Um, the bad part is I forgot my camera at home. So I'm going to go through this box and see what we can find. Okay, so yeah. Um, there was... Ooh, there was like four damaged boxes. But I wasn't able... I don't know went wild I wasn't able to go through them on camera because I didn't have it with me so I did save a box to go through on camera and it's 
it's not that I haven't been wanting to put up videos. There's just so much competition out now that it's so hard to find anything. Okay, so we'll sit right here. These little things on top are what came out of the other boxes, like another perfume. And sometimes I have found things, they have been just completely destroyed. Okay, there's a camera. Shit. Okay, I don't know if you can see it from there. This is the first bit of stuff I found in like a month and a half. Okay, I think there might be damage to the bag. Let me see what else is in the bag. Let me get this stuff out and then. That is so cute, even if it don't have no makeup in it. Okay. I didn't lose this. Okay. I got gloves because this is a bunch of food. Shoot. Gross. Okay. I'm not home. So. Before I take this bag in, I do want to get there's a little shadow. Oh, I don't know if there's anything in here. I think I grab the whole bag. Yeah, they're just an empty little thing. Okay. This is a bunch of mixed stuff. Oh, yeah, one's busted, so I'm going to have to get some gloves on and go through that. But then in here, we got cover all facts and I just oh I'm not done. and I just got a bunch of these a couple days ago from another also they just were really covered in that makeup a lot but I'm gonna go and we'll go through everything in a haul. Look guys I don't know if you can see but right there's a ton of makeup and stuff. I just got some out I'm gonna go ahead and try to get the rest and then we'll see what all we can accumulate. Holy crap, guys. Oh my god, it goes all the way down. Oh my god. This is gonna take a while. I'm gonna get this out and we'll check it out. Okay, 
containers on the top floors. So that means they are doing a huge reset. I'm going to go to every altar today. Definitely something broken. some Smashbox. I did find this, which I'm going to use for like organizing my gel polishes. And here, I Little eyeshadow things are really cool. I didn't find them last time. I mean, I have them because I've found them before, but. Got some more. This big bubble wrap I put on my. So if you see a bunch of my trunk, that's why it helps bring my bills down. Oh, this was used up quite a bit. That it was just pushed on, fresh and frosted. Another one. And another one. I wonder if that's the one. Tinted moisturizer. Yeah, cool. Okay, so I'm gonna go through the rest of this bag and yeah. Hey guys, welcome to the haul. This is a ginormous haul, my biggest haul yet. Um, I will say that since, well, I'm gonna say since my last video, I believe it was October, I did not find anything and I went day in, day out. I put 6,000 miles on my car I just got. And in the last three weeks, this is what I found. And most of it was just this past week. Um, so I'm going to just like skim over these boxes. And then my next video is going to be a more in-depth video of what you see here. So yeah, let's get into it. So this is like a couple body um, so or lotions and then some shampoos. Here is more skincare. There's that. We got some Lancome, First Aid Beauty, Dermalogica, Juice Beauty, Truly Organic. We have so much stuff here, it's unreal. Um, there's a perfume box and body spray. There's some body sprays in here. Um, this is like the drugstore style or foundation and stuff. Um, here is some more skincare. I literally have not cleaned nothing in this box and nothing in this box um and i've not added up these three boxes of retail value so basically the majority of it um came up to a little over fourteen thousand dollars in retail um let's see so yeah 
let's start looking at these palettes because I don't want this to be an extremely long video, which I kind of feel like it's going to be because of how huge it is. So there's that palette. Um, we got two of the NARS. I guess I should have had this like opened and ready to show you guys. There's the NARS one. And I was so surprised to see any damage boxes with anything in the boxes. So yeah, like that really made my day. And then to turn around and go to another store the next day and see all the skincare was just really exciting. So is what we plan on doing is selling it by the box full. Like we'll post some of this stuff like this um, to our Macari and then most likely, like the boxes of skincare and stuff, it'd be like an open box buy on Macari. We may end up doing another live, I'm not sure, but we got these. Um, we got this. I'm gonna try to go through it as much as I can, but like I said, I don't want it to be a really long video. And then this kind of, I'm gonna show you. When I was taking the tape off right through here, um, in that little area, it tried lifting. But yeah, so here's this. See the little nick in it? I believe that happened when I um, opened it to realize it was new and the little brush fell down on it. We got tons and tons, just with the foundations and skin tints alone, and then this Cover FX dropper stuff. The retail value of that was like five grand. So yeah, um, I found a ton of these Smashbox uh, photo finish setting powders. All these, like everything is still new right here. There's that, it's got a swatch, but. New. I just, just got done cleaning some more of this, so I'll probably have some purple shampoo in my nails. I got this. Oh, I got these lids off, look, brand new. I love them. And these, on, there's a tinted mineral veil and original. I didn't find the lids to those. So I just put some lids on that I had. So yeah, pretty stoked about this haul. Like I'm going to do this little in-depth detail of what you see out and then I'm going to show you the rest of the haul. When I seen these, they were in the box and they had like foundation and all type of things dumped all over the box. Luckily it didn't stain because it didn't get on the product itself. Um, I wish I could have saved the box because I have two sets of these and they're like $130 a piece. But uh, we got a bag of the little Lancome foundations. A bag of, I think this is eyeshadow, if I'm not mistaken. Um, let's see, this was in the box, that was in the box. I got two of these, I just, I'm already using one. Um, so these, it says that they're missing the, the gel, but when I, and them there's the gel and there's the um, brow pencil on both of them they're both in there so I'm not exactly sure what that is about but yeah so we got some benefit some makeup revolution Ulta brand and some more drugstore brand I found all of these nails in a giant bag at Ulta and I just threw them in here because I feel like I like doing nails and that can give me inspiration but then these sets um, they're like a four piece set they're like $60 a piece so I figured those are pretty cool these are brand new still sealed even though they were displays they're still sealed so that's pretty neat um, there's some steel stuff in here in the box, Buxom, I got three of them, little lip things, so 
Phoenix and Benefits and Anastasia. Over here, we got a bag of um, just a lot of different um, perfumes. We got these perfumes, some Nest, let's see, Dulce & Gabbana, Burberry. There's just so much stuff here. It's, yes, it has been a ride. But, yeah, so, um, I did kind of want to get an idea of something. So, I do nails, like, just on the side when I'm not making sales on my Macari and basically just friends and family. But I don't know if you guys would be interested in watching me design my nails sometimes. So, I was thinking about either adding it to this and doing DIYs with it too because I do those a lot also when I'm bored and not diving. So I was thinking about changing the name of the channel just so everyone knows it's not like strictly dumpster diving because as you see it's been a while since I've done a video and I just want to keep in touch and um yeah be able to upload more videos and if I'm not able to do it dumpster diving I'd like to do it in another way. So tell me what you guys think about that idea and I will see you in the next update of this part two to show you the rest of the skincare.